what's up guys so welcome to a new video so yeah guys great news great news we going to get the gt online summer update next week on july 26 tuesday man i am very excited about this so rockstar games said it on the newswire they came up with a new trailer but also with a lot of information so yeah let's go through that information first and then i'll show you guys the trailer so basically what this update is about, there's going to be a big gas crisis in San Andreas. And the corrupt drug and petrochemical family are rigging the system in their favor. So the IAA or the CIA in the game, they want to hire the player to put the pieces together. So Rockstar Games says in the newswire, go on the cover in Operation Paper Trail. The profits from soaring gas prices all seem to be flowing one way into the pockets of the most notorious Ulrich dynasty in the Los Santos area. The IAA smells a criminal conspiracy. Agent ULP will be in touch with the new Operation Paper Trail. So nice, nice. ULP will be back. For the people that don't know who's ULP, he was in GTA 4 as well. Commissioning one to four players as sworn in agent to investigate the local petrochemical magnates, the Duggans, to see if they are the invisible hand behind spiraling oil prices. And then Rockstar Games added this picture. You see a uh, online player with an IAA outfit, so probably we can get this IAA outfit as well. Pretty cool. Looks like he's in a hotel room, so that's also nice. Maybe it's going to be our, our operation center. You also see a drone in the back nice so rockstar game says in newswire they're going to add some new vehicles through the summer so it's going to be drip fed it and they're also coming a lot of new imani tech vehicles so that's pretty nice i like the imani tech and then rockstar games added a picture of this four-door sedan also a nice car looks like it's armored and stuff i like it rockstar games going to add cars like this and there also come some new tuner vehicles, brand new original vehicles and also how it's going to work on existing vehicles and how also going to work on uh, new vehicles later this summer for the new generation of consoles. And with that text they added this picture of this Audi RS7. I really love this car, I'm definitely going to get this car. The Audi RS7 is one of the best cars in real life so probably also in the game. So this update is going to bring some new missions and upgrades to GT Online including significant expansion to business prospect for criminal careers plus new elaborate contact missions with players operating as a sworn in agent for the IEA. So that's pretty cool and yeah it starts on July 26. Rockstar Games also going to improve the payouts for the missions. And also other improvements with new modes, vehicle collectibles and special events dropping all summer long. So like Rockstar says there, it's going to be drip fed. So, but that's not a problem. I like the drip feed so you got every week something new instead of everything at the same moment. So yeah, let's go on. And something very requested by the currently Rockstar is going to add is going to be cell missions going to be available to play in private and invite only crew and friend session so that's pretty good because we were waiting for that a long time because every time you start a cell mission you are going to get griefed so that, that that was something normal but now we can do it in private sessions and stuff i'm very happy about that let's make this money rockstar games also added this picture in the news why post and you can see some people shooting here yeah, you can see this uh gt online players one looks a bit like my character but yeah they shooting in an auto shop so that's pretty cool probably a mission so people that chose the executive path they will get a new staff manager and her name will be lupe and uh, what rockstar game says about it ready and able to help source additional special cargo for your empty shells a new side gig will also open up for executives where a shipment of special cargo will arrive daily outside your warehouse packed and ready for delivery to the docks. Plus two new sources of special cargo will also be added to the mix of source missions, increasing the variety of missions available to white collar criminals statewide. So pretty cool, we're going to get some new staff member, her name will be Lupe, probably Guadalupe, Mexican, because uh, that's a real Mexican name, a Mexican girl probably, because uh, in Mexico we always call the Guadalupe's Lupe, so yeah that's pretty cool. 
Then Rockstar Games say something about bikers. They add this real cool picture. You see this custom bike with the machine guns on it and with the spikes. Pretty cool though. I think it will be a custom bike. You can customize it like that. And also it got the armor on the back. So what Rockstar Games says about this bikers. Clubhouses with the custom bike shop are getting the on the house upgrade where MC presidents will be able to modify clients bikes to specifications and deliver them to customers for GT money now P. I think this is just a bit like the cars they make at the mod shop. Bikers will also be able to bolster the street, cred and bottom lines by completing two new clubhouse contracts posted on the meeting room wall at the clubhouse. And you might notice patrons hunting the bar in your clubhouse, so that's nice. Some people will be in your clubhouse because it was always very empty, only you had the woman that's working there. A bar resupply mission will keep the cags tapped and the clientele happy while earning a little extra income for your MC. So that's also pretty cool. Bar resupply, so you get some people in your MC clubhouse all the time, that's pretty cool. I think it's a bit just like the nightclub that you have to do these missions and then you get more people in your uh, bar so that's pretty nice as well and then let's go to gun running you see this guy he has a new haircut some uh, shooting glasses on pretty cool though and you see he got the m4 rifle nice nice looks really good i'm uh, looking forward to shoot with that so gun runners also get some new missions pretty cool one they can resupply all the emanations on the map and also they can do the resupply missions from the road so that will be easier you don't have to go to your bunker all the time and then let's go to nightclub owners rockstar games starts with this picture looks like a player is uh, being a bouncer and dropping a guy out so that's pretty cool maybe we can do that as well America. someone's making a picture the nightclub owners also get a new contact and his name will be johan so he will be an employee of the nightclub probably and there are also going to be some new missions to the roster and also nightclub owners can now call Tony to launch club management missions so that will be easier instead of going to the nightclub all the time uh, that's pretty nice and yeah let's go on so Rockstar Games is going to nerf the Oppress MK2 and also it's going to be easy to replenish health during firefights with more convenient access to snacks and armor and much more. So, so let's go to this trailer guys and guys take a good look at this trailer because you're going to see races on Cayo Perico and there's a dealership opening in front of Dr. Dre studio. So yeah, let's go. Breaking news. It is hot out there, folks. This summer continues to break records for the hottest temperature since last year. We know you're definitely not heading out of town, not with these gas prices. <laughs> it's insane. It's like I'm back in 1981. Oil tycoons are back in style. Which is good for business, right? You know Zero, that big oil company? Just got a shipment hit by pirates. We got a way to make bank off of it, man. You ever heard of the Duggins? Oil and gas people making some serious dollar with the prices being high, yo. Today's serving of crazy comes with heavy ballistic armor and anger management issues. I smell a conspiracy. This is only the beginning. 